you ever get tired? I'm tired, but I'm still going to do this video right here. What's going on, guys? I'm Vintage Man, and that Captain America Civil War, boy, oh boy, am I excited for it. I made a video talking about some, some Civil War stuff uh, in my last video, talking about Captain America Civil War video for last, talking about how the Century 6 movie could connect to this uh, Civil War, could, meaning it was an idea, it was not a theory, it was an idea, some people were getting a little bit, it's not going to happen, I'm like, it was just an idea. Um, before, check out my last video, my Grand Theft Auto video, talking about my wish list, what they could add, check out my video before that, the Grand Theft Auto, I mean, um, Captain America 1, Century 6, Captain America, all that stuff, description. Also, I have a radio show every Saturday at 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on UrbanNationRadio.com slash live now. It's called Venom Time, in which I talk about movies, video games, technology, all that good jazz. Now, onto this video. Captain America, boy, oh boy, I'm so excited to see the Civil War. Now, I want to say this flat out, straight up, I can't wait to see Iron Man get his butt beat. I cannot wait to see him get his butt beat. But, I also... Can't wait to see the other characters be in this film because there are so many characters in the Marvel Cinematic Universe that the possibilities are endless for the amount of people that they can add to and maybe introduce new characters in here and stuff like that. So there's so much they could do. And yes, I was wrong. I know. I I said they of course they wouldn't, you know, make the Civil War be in one movie because in the comics is such a long storyline but I mean you know they're doing it in one movie and I have faith in them and I trust them and I think they could do it and I'm really excited to see it and um here's an idea I don't think uh Hulk is going to be in it he may be in it I mean I've been wrong before I was wrong about this before so I could be wrong about it now but I don't think Hulk is going to be in I think he, they are going to send him uh, off into space he's going to be with the Guardians of the Galaxy and that's going to be a way for them to bridge Thanos and Earth um with him Hulk being with the Guardians of the Galaxy and the Guardians of the Galaxy saying that, well, and um, Drax saying that Thanos is the person he's after next. So I think that's that's a good good way to connect. Um, sending Hawk off because Ultron did something to him that makes him go crazy, something like that. You know, that's a good way to connect um, Hawk with the Guardians and bring Earth and Thanos, or oh, Earth and these galactic beings together. That's a good way. Um, even though you know Star Lord is from Earth, but you know this is just another bridge. Uh, so, yeah, and I think Civil, uh, Cat Hawk being gone for the Civil War, it kind of, it kind of evens the playing field in a way, because Hawk being on one team, he just smashed everybody. Um, so, yeah, but this is the big bombshell. I think that by the end of Captain America Civil War, Captain America is going to die. I think he will die. In the comics, he dies. I think he will die at the end of this movie, and he will be brought back um, in the Avengers um, 3, Infinity War, either part 1 or part 2. He'll be brought back um, using the the Infinity Gauntlet. So, I do think he's going to die because it's very shocking for them to do that. Um, I do think he's going to come back because he's Captain America. And maybe, perhaps, when with him being gone, Bucky takes his place, or maybe even Falcon, someone. Um, but I think, you know, they are going to kill Steve Rogers. He's going to die. And then he will be replaced, maybe, with another Captain America. And then by the end of um, the uh, Avengers 1, Avengers 3, Part 1 or Part 2, either by the end or the beginning of that film, will have him be resurrected. Especially, you know, that's what's been happening to Marvel. Somebody dies and they come back. You know, that happens over and over, so I, hey, might as well keep on happening, right? Um, but yeah, that'd be very interesting, very shocking for them to end Captain America 3 with his own demise in his own movie. Um, so yeah, that's interesting. And then, you know, how that would lead on, how that would affect Tony Stark, how that would affect the government, all that stuff. That'd be very interesting to play, too, as well. What do you guys think about this? Let's have that conversation in the comments below. I really want to talk about this, guys, down there. So I really want to hear you guys' opinions. I want to have this conversation. Um, I want to be down there. If you're new to this video, if you're new to this channel, subscribe. Hit that subscribe button. If you like this video, hit the like button. If you didn't, hit the dislike button. Share this video around with all of your friends if you did enjoy it. I'm going to zoom in. As always, thank you guys for watching. Um, and I hope you guys have a great day, a great week, a great weekend. I hope to see you. Tune in for UrbanNationRadio.com for Venom Time this Saturday. And, um, peace, guys. That's really it. Peace. I'm going to be down there. I'm going to be reading, and I want to be having a conversation. Peace, guys. Have a good one. Peace. I have to walk off because that's just what I do for some reason. I don't know. I don't know. Peace. Venom 2 million.